OK, well, that's just about the end of the lecture. Um, before we finish, I suppose I want to mention some of the gases that are in very, very small components. Well, one of them is argon. OK, this is the 1% that we see here, the red colour of the pocket. And this is in the same family of gases as, as helium that we see, the light gas floating up with our balloons there. Helium, neon, argon, krypton, xenon. Um, we're going to show one property of helium. Well, the property is, of course, that it's lighter than air, and this is why we use it to fill our balloons. But why is it lighter? Each atom of helium is much, much lighter than oxygen. And remember, we saw the effects of the air pushing down on us. Well, if helium is used instead, it doesn't push down so much because it doesn't weigh so much. And this can actually affect my voice if I breathe in some helium, which is what I'm going to do in a moment. Well, as I'm speaking, my vocal cords are vibrating, but they're pushing back the air, which is what you're hearing. You're hearing the vibrations in the air. But if I breathe in some helium, because helium's so much lighter, it doesn't have to push so much. And actually, my vocal cords vibrate much faster. And this makes my voice go up. So here we have some medical helium and oxygen mixed up in just the right proportions to allow me to breathe it safely. Um, so I'm going to try breathing in this mixture of helium and oxygen. <sighs> So now if I speak, my voice has indeed gone up. OK, I hope you appreciate this. It's my vocal cords vibrating faster. It's be beginning to return back to normal now, thank goodness. But this demonstrates the how, because uh, helium is so light, my vocal cords vibrate much faster. <laughs> oh, right. Now, that really is just about the end of the lecture there. Um, but I think it's always very important to go out with a bit of a bang. Well, for those of you that came last year, you will remember the uh, little bunny. Well, this time we have a little sheep. OK. And so we're going to now convert this poor little sheep into some gas, I think. OK, so here he is. OK, we have the lights down. So now he's a solid. And let's make him a gas. <laughs> All gone. Thank you very much. Thank you.